All right, hi, my name's Richard. I've come from the Winsdale Creamery up in Halls, home of the famous Yorkshire Winsdale. And today I'm going to show you how I'd make my perfect Yorkshire Winsdale sandwich. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use some Yorkshire, Jackson's Champion Bread. We're going to add some of our Dale's butter. It creates a good barrier if you're having uh, moist ingredients. Now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to use some traditional Yorkshire Winsdale cheese. And I'm going to add a couple of ingredients to that just to make it a, a really superb sandwich. And then some of these sliced fine tomatoes, which will just work lovely, really there we go, some of these nice peppery rocket leaves. Nice bit of a Mediterranean flavor. And finally, a good healthy twist of cracked black pepper, there we are. And there we have a Yorkshire Winston Ale with tomato and rocket sandwich on brown bread. Okay, what I'd like to do now is invite you two lads up to have a go at making your perfect Yorkshire Winston Ale sandwich. Suit in that apron, Pat out. Thank you very much. My wife's a vegetarian, so I like to do a lot of vegetarian food for her. I'm going to try and impress her. Shall, okay. I, shall I crack on? A pie or me? What about you, man? I'm going to just have a mash the uh, lathering of butter, and then have a bit of bacon on there, and a bit of a bit of the salad, salad things yeah, in there, and just to experiment thing. around. The uh, Yorkshire Wednesday cheese on here. Take a bit of the apple. Might not leave any for you, Carl. If it goes with the apple, then I might even use the jam. I've got to think outside the box. I mean, the... this is true. Yeah, exactly. Does that look good to you? Looks hellish, that. Right? Give a little pepper now. So you're basically copying me. Uh, well, not quite, Pato, because I'm gonna I'm gonna even introduce a bit of uh, uh, jam for the bottom layering of Ooh, the. Oh, that's top controversial. Side of bread. We go one or two ways, that. So we've got pepper and jam. Yeah, it's interesting well. concoction. But he's a brave man. He's a braver man than I am. Well, I like to experiment. I'm gonna slice it the traditional way, and that is my. Yorkshire Wednesday Dill cheese sandwich. I'll probably win with that, won't I? <laughs> Maybe. Unless you like pepper and jam. It's a very uh, yeah. uh, packed sandwich and just slap the uh, bacon on top. Not going well, it. Mm -hmm. There we go. Yeah. Oh, it's just popped out that. And that is my Yorkshire Wednesday Dill sandwich. Well, as you can see, it's quite a messy sandwich. You can obviously see his fingerprints on the bread as well, that just adds to the flavour, I'm sure. Well, I suppose I'll have to have a taste of these then, won't I? You can see you're impressed over here, haven't you? I do taste very good, Mum. I thought it would. Mm. Right, here we go, first of all. What to take in. The Oxford Winter Ale always traditionally compliments sweet flavours. That's not bad. That's not bad, man. It's an adventurous approach. Oh, you've got to go bold and be something different. When it comes down to it, I'm going to have to stay traditional, I'm afraid, man. Thank you very much. You've taken it, man. You've taken it, man. Thanks. Thanks, Carl. Thanks. I appreciate your competition. Yeah, yeah. Three fantastic sandwiches. I'm sure you'll agree.